So we discussed about movie clip only, movie clip. There are graphic symbol also. I mean, in same like movie clip, graphic symbol also. What's the difference between the graphic and movie clip? We will discuss. Still, I know you have done it, but still you, you might have some doubt on about movie clips. So we are doing one exercise, very simple exercise. I'm not making you complication with multiple layers, multiple movie clip, nothing. Very simply, a set of keyframe animation keeping in a movie clip. Okay, a set of keyframe animations I'm keeping in a movie clip. When I was taking about movie clip, multiple layers, multiple uh, movie clip inside and all, some of you may have doubt, some confusion here and there. Now it will clear with this exercise. I'm going back to the base, but with some proper exercise. I have a flying cycle. What do you mean by cycle? See, this is an image. I've taken this one to Illustrator. Cycle means something, uh, uh, you see, the, this is the first frame and the end frame also same. In any cycle, walk cycle, run cycle, uh, a flying cycle. So this cycle means one set of animation is doing, but starting and beginning will be same, okay? If this one, if I'm repeating again, you feel like the complete cycle is it, it's flying. So I don't want to draw frame by frames. I'm trying these images I will take to Adobe Animate. So this is connected. You can always do this one Illustrator because if you face some difficult draw in Adobe Animate, always you can come back to Adobe Illustrator and try to create the frame. So you draw whatever you want. Then it can, you can directly copy paste to Animate. So this is an image now I go to tracing and use uh, three color. So you get with this dot. Click on expand. So this all are individual. Ungroup, Shift, Control, G or object and group, and then you can go, you can get it all individually, this all, correct? See what I'm trying now. Here, I'm importing the first one, okay? So before you remember, I told you two methods. One, I'm creating a new symbol inside that I'm creating. That's making a little difficult because I don't know the boundary of the frame. I don't know how much size I need and all. So I feel very comfort to do this one. Directly I selected from here, control C, go to Adobe animate and control V, paste it. So I got one character directly. When I press control V, it will ask you an option, paste as a bitmap. Do you want this one as a bitmap, as an image or paste using Adobe Illustrator direct means using import preference. It will work like Adobe Illustrator file only. Uh, apply recommended import settings to resolve the comp that is all okay maintain layers if you want to keep them if you have multiple layers it will maintain the layers just okay don't use as bitmap because there is chance to get pixel okay if you use as uh, adobe illustrator file you will get like how you imported from the same way you're going to get it over here right so we have taken one okay now see what i'm trying this one i press f8 i'm converting to this is a bird Movie clip. It's a very simple way, no complication. No multiple layers, no multiple movie clip. One image I import, I press F8, convert to symbol, giving a name and press OK. Simple. Okay. I go inside here. Now, when I go inside, same image will be the correct. Okay. Next, I press one F6 extra. Next F6. In that F6, I select this one and delete it. If I switch on my onion skin, I will be understanding the previous frame where it is, right? This is the previous frame. Now here, I want to import my second frame. This one, control C, copy, come back here, control V. It may come somewhere else here. So you need to take this one to the same place now. We need to adjust the up and down and all that will come to later. Now I'm gonna keep it on the same place. Okay, so this one, I got it in another layer by mistake. Let me do it again. Only one layer is enough, no confusion. Go to this frame, then control V. Okay, no need multiple layers. You know one thing, when you're pasting, switch off this one, maintain layer, maintain layer. So it will not maintain one by one layer, okay? So we need on the same frame. So one frame, I'm gonna keep it here. Again, I press F6 and we delete it. And we import the third one, copy and paste it, control V, maintain layer switch off, and we keep here. Click F6, delete the frame, take the next image from Illustrator, copy, 
come back, paste it, keep on same place without layers. I want to keep on same layers. Continue the same thing. F6, delete. Next one, copy. It's a little bit detail animation that wings. Uh, so, um, you can see the wings are, see, we took around six frames, right? Four, five, six frames to come up to down. Up to down, it took six frames. Now from here, F6, delete it, copy, paste it, no layer, same place now, F6, delete, next one, copy and paste, I'm uh, sorry, yeah, paste, maintain layer off, here, F6, delete, I'm sorry. Next one, copy and paste. Maintain. F6, delete. And this one, this is the last one. This is the last one. We don't need uh, this one because this both are same. That means this is a movie clip. After this one, instantly it go back to this one. So this is the next frame. Okay. So when you switch off this onion skin and all, when you play, you understand now. Correct. Control enter. Control enter. Little bit jerking happens. So we, we, we need to switch on onion skin and see what happens over here. See the movement here. Fine. Okay. Right. It's a bit too, changes will be there. It's a loud drawing. Right. It's very fast. So I want slow a little bit. So what I can do? See, I'm outside. I have only movie clip, right? I go inside here. Press one F5. F5. Everywhere, one by one, F5 I'm pressing. That means multiple images, multiple sequence. I mean, one frame extra I'm adding there. One frame extra. It's a little slowly now. I think eyes are moving in some of the frames. Eyes position got different. Okay. That's from the picture we need to see. Big changes happened here to here. Let me check I can manage or not. It's big changes happens. Control enter. Little bit movement difference other because of eyes, okay? You can ignore for time being that. Okay, now what we have done, this all inside a movie clip, right? First, I repeating one more time. I directly copy one image, first image, copy and paste to Adobe Animate. Then I selected that, F8, convert to movie clip, go inside the movie clip and next frame F6, import it. Next F6, delete and import it like that. All the frames I have done. Okay. Now, when I press Control Enter, I'm getting this result now. Now, from outside the scene, I've taken this image here. Go till here, F6, right click, classic tween. I can go to the last frame, switch off all this. So, when I press Control Enter, it's animating. Now, in another layer, if I want one more, I can one more here. See. In another layer, window library, we have cycle here. One is enough. Maybe one I kept it here. Control C, Control V, copy paste of this movie clip. And this one is smaller. Copy paste. Okay. And this one I'm animating separate. Okay. 
So I'm animating separate because uh, I want to show you two layers we are working. See, one is working over there. This one slowly will go. So control enter. Because another one I can get to different speed, right? Because it's in a different layer. I can keep a background. I can keep a sky. I can animate that separate. Okay. So this all inside the movie clip. Anytime, even if I delete this all, no problem. I remove everything from here. Keep one F6. There is nothing here. Anytime I can get back because this is in your library. When you press control enter, bird is already here. So you never delete from the. Do not delete from the library. Okay. Even if you delete from here, no problem. You can take multiple copy. For example, one you want to uh, flying from here to here. One you want to flying flying from other side. You can do that. What you have to do, cut and paste to another layer, F6, and paste here. And this one, we have flip and all for time being, I just directly do this way manually. And one from here, F6, sorry, F6, F6, both classic twin, classic twin. And this one to go here, little bit rotation also. This one to here. Rotation also. Control enter. Right, one go, one up. So now from here, if you want any movement different, F6. Go here. Okay. Right. So here you don't be able to see any movement. See the wings movement cannot see. When you press enter, you will be able to see this one only. So that's the difference between movie clip and graphic symbol. In graphic symbol, you can see when you move like this, you can see inside animation, but movie clip, you cannot. Well, I'll come to the difference separate. Now you understood very simple way I explained to you. Inside I have a key frames, frame by frame animation. Outside I have a classic twin.